Okay. I'm Matt Wyatt. Thanks for stopping by this channel where I use my experience in media, radio, TV, video production, and podcasting to explain how to get the most out of your gear while saving a little money the way that I do. It's been a while since I posted here, and it's good to be back. This is the solution to the battery issues with the original Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera. It's the small rig NPF battery plate, and there's a few reasons I'm using it on the Blackmagic original beyond just the fact that it sends 12 volt power for the camera. Now here's a link to the previous video I did on the Blackmagic uh, camera. In it, I explained how not only are the original batteries that come with the camera notoriously weak, but mine, I bought the camera used on eBay, my battery won't even stay in the camera very well. So I initially went with the NPF style adapter you could find on the internet. It worked. However, the drawbacks were that it's plastic, it's clunky, you know, you could work around that. Plus, you had no way of tracking the remaining power on the Sony MPF battery that you were using. You had 12 volts of DC power one second, then the next, poof, gone. Now, side note, just for those who may be new to this stuff, the Sony NPF style batteries, I have one right here. It's these things, they're universal, that are reliable, they come in three sizes, generally power all kinds of stuff in the video world, like lights and monitors, all kinds of stuff. I had a bunch of them on hand and it made sense to look for a way to use them to power the Blackmagic original. When this new solution, the small rig plate came out, I pre-ordered it like before it was even in stock. It took a while to arrive, but once it did, I've been so happy that I bought it. Here are the reasons I recommend it. Number one, it's metal, not cheap plastic like the other one. Something sturdy instead of something breakable. Give that to me all day, every day. Number two, it's a smaller, lower profile than the previous adapter I was using. It comes equipped with a quarter size thread that you can screw on the top, which allows for either attaching it to your cage like I do or directly to the threads on the top of the camera. So instead of sticking up and twisting around, this is tight, secure, and doesn't move wherever you put it. Number three, it has a battery indicator inside the adapter. This was a huge selling point for me. You just press the button on the side while the battery is still plugged in and the lights will indicate how much power you have remaining. It doesn't give you a number, but any indication of remaining battery power is better than no indication. Now, I feel more comfortable using the smallest uh, MPF battery, not this one, the 550 size, because now I can track when I'm getting low. Side note, I like using the smaller 550 size batteries because again, it makes for a lower profile on the camera. And the last thing I'd point out, number four, I guess, the adapter also comes equipped with a 7.4 volt output. So you could use it for devices that need 7.4 instead of 12. It's just an added bonus. So there you go. It's a nice upgrade from the previous battery adapter option that I shared with you. And I highly recommend this. If you want to buy one, you can get one for like 60 bucks on Amazon and B&H. And I've provided a link in the description to both spots for you. This is not sponsored. I bought this one myself and I'm using it so I can vouch for it. Would you mind leaving me a comment? Let me know if you've used this or if you have a better solution in terms of powering the original Blackmagic camera. I'd love to know if y'all have found anything better. Thanks in advance. And if you wouldn't mind, hit that like button for me. That really helps a lot. If you have any feedback, questions, anything like that, hit me up on social media. I'm Radio Wyatt. I'd really appreciate your suggestions, any ideas for the future and future videos. Anything you'd like to see me talk about or review, just let me know. Thanks, and I'll see you on the next one.